I just want to share a moment in, in, in the book and a nugget, I call it spiritual nugget. I want to bless you. The Lord has given us 86,400 seconds throughout the day. What do you do with that, with, with those seconds? What do you do with them? When you find yourself overwhelmed, when you find yourself depressed, oppressed, when you find yourself uh, trying to figure out the amount of dream, what do you do with those seconds? How much of those seconds the devil owns and how much of those seconds you give to God? The devil might, the devil wants to own and God wants to, God wants you to give some of those seconds to him. I will give them most of the second, how to be mindful, how to be thankful, how to be grateful throughout the day, how to stop and meditate, how to stop and throw up a hallelujah up in the air, how to stop and say, Lord, you're worthy of it all. How, how, how are you just overwhelmed with, with, with issues and problems and, 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 and really mindsets that are, that, that are in and out? Uh, in the, out of the kingdom, in back into the kingdom, into the world, and out. And the devil is eating up those seconds. And then when you get to the end of your night, you say, "What happened today? Uh, I don't know what I did today. My 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 day went by, and I can't even recap what happened." Many Christians are living that kind of life. And I teach you in the book, exposing the devil's playbook, eighty six thousand four hundred seconds. What do you do with those seconds that God has given you? that he woke you up this morning and he set you on your way. What do you do with those seconds? 86,400 seconds. Do you meditate? Do you give him honor? Did you give him glory? Did you stop? As you stop and take a deep breath, did you stop and throw up a hallelujah? Because when you start doing these things, your mind starts your mind start to be transformed. It becomes automatic. And then the devil can steal something that is in the presence of God. And, and, and we think that we need to worship God in the prayer closet. The world is your prayer closet. It's time to get up and take your 86,400 seconds and do something about it. And the book teaches you how to use your time. The Bible says, redeem your time. The days are evil. Outside in the world are evil. And also in your life, the devil is trying to bring evil. The devil is trying to bring destruction. The devil is trying to bring setups. And they're never trying to bring worry and fear and unbelief. We see it on the news. We see it on television. We hear it on the radio. We see it in your neighborhoods. What are you doing with your 86,400 seconds? Who your seconds belong to? Let me teach you. Let me equip you. Let me disciple you to the book that is called Exposing the Devil's Playbook. Listen, he has a playbook on you. It's time that you have a playbook on him. Love you guys. I love you so much. I tell you, you are vessels of honor. Don't quit. Don't stop. Don't give up. Finish what God started in you. And make Jesus Christ proud that he picked you. Amen.